Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel, The Girl Through Rose Tattoos. My name's Becca and sorry I look a mess today. I just got back from Disney World and I had so much fun. But since I got back from Disney World, I did a lot of pin training. So that means I need to organize my pin books. Again, so this is going to be like part one of three since I got like six pin books to try and fix up. So let's do these two pin books. This is going to turn to my trader book and then I got another big pin book there and I took out all the pins that need to go in these two um and so let's sit down and organize these and I'll put some nice music on as I organize them and I hope you enjoy okay so we also have this giant book over here but we're gonna start by taking all of the pins out of this book here because this is like I said gonna be turning into a trader book and of course I got all these lovely hidden mickeys in here and I think I traded for all of these um, country bear ones and I will show an amazing one that I got on my trip. And I put these in order of how they say on the back because that is how my mind works. And I love these. I want more of the Mickey pins. I'm just so picky about the ones that I like. And these ones I really don't care what order they go in. But these are some of the little packs that you only get like one in of each. And we got this. I finally completed this set. I got the pen. It took me forever to complete this set. Still working on this set. Still need the dull Whip for this one. got my BFF collection which I still need two more I got a whole bunch sitting in this pile of pins right below me ignore my watch and then we got the hug series which I also love and I only need one more from this series and that is Dumbo and his jumbo um, so here we go Ugh. I'm trying to grab these through the camera is kind of difficult, honestly. So, look at all these pins that I got, guys. So, let's sort through these real quick. So, this is going to go in this book. This book over here, I put like all my monthly pins in and pin sets. This is another monthly pin. Let's see what this is. This is going to go over there. This is like the monthly, um, family series and I love these and I'm trying to click all of them they just released three new ones guys because I can't keep up so we got all of those to go in this look I'll put those over there and also I have my goofy collection but I'm going to get rid of some of these goofies so I can trade and these ones I'm getting not him these ones I'm getting rid of to trade in the parks you know I love dogs and cats I'm trying to really minimize my collections so I'm gonna trade those in the parks and then I got I only need one more balloon and I'm finding it impossible to find and that is the what balloon not Nemo flounder balloon we got this one which is the last one I needed I found it so hard to find um find him and look we have the best friends series and the only best friends I need are Lilo and Stitch and then Genie and Aladdin. This is going in the pen trader book. And then we got Bambi and Thumper. And I think I got more laying around somewhere. So Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Do you guys know the difference between them? I think I do. I think Dewey's the blue one. Huey is the red and Louie is the green, right? Is that right? Let me know. And then this is another trader pin. Let's see what we got left. Oopsies. Trader. Trader. The little nautical one. Gonna go in the series for the Kingdom of Cute. This is from series two. And then we got another trader upside. I mean, kind of goes that way. No, it's upside down. This is another 
one that we're keeping. And then we got a trader and then a Gucci pen. And then let me show you the pins I traded for while I was at Disney because I had lots of fun trading. It's my new addiction that I'm obsessed with. Does anyone else like get addicted to stuff and like have to do it all the time? Or is that just me? And then I got this one for my kingdom cute. And I'm just taking the backs off some of these goofies. I don't know if I showed you all of them, but I think this is from the 90th collection of Goofy dressed. I love Goofy pins of him dressed in different outfits. This is also gonna go in my trader book. It's cute, but I like dressing, I like Goofy in different outfits. So that is what I collect. So these pins here, um, I got in the parks. So I think this is, I think it's fake, but I love me Vinyl Motion pins. So I picked up this, this is the cutest one that I found of the Vinyl Motion pins and actually have the vinyl for that. So we're gonna be keeping that one. I only brought nine pins to trade. Then I love these kawaii ones and I'm trying to collect them all. I was gonna go in the trade book for now, just so I know what ones I'm looking for. And this was the most exciting find, guys. I found two new, brand new Avenger Hidden Mickey pins. Avenger Hidden Mickey? So I found two of them all in the park and they just came out last month. So excited. I didn't find any of the other brand new pins, but I was only looking for mostly the Avengers ones, so I didn't find any more. And then I think he's a scrapper, but it's the com it's the last one I needed for my big feet collection. And this is the completer pen of Dumbo. And I'm gonna put that in my book, even though I think he might be a fake. It's hard. I he might be, but I 100 percent not sure. He doesn't seem like it's me. But I'm not an expert on fake pens. Also, this was an exciting find, Carousel of Progress. He's going to go in the trader book. Not to trade, but just so I know what I'm looking for. Also, this was the most exciting one ever. And it is authentic. It is the completer, not the completer. Completer pen for my um, country bear set. And I pulled this out of a mystery box. I thought it was so cool. I didn't think I was going to get this one because I'm like, eh, if I find it, I find it. If I don't, I don't. I'm okay with it. But he's Big Al and he's my favorite. And then I got another one of those kawaii pins of the wasp. These ones are scrapped a lot, actually. And the three that I found are actually authentic, surprisingly. So let's do this book first and set up my trader book so that when I go to the park next month I can have my trader book already. So we're just going to put these in here at random and these are all the ones that I will be trading in the park when I go. I'm probably going for Valentine's Day but don't quote me on that. That might change depending on life. So, there we go. We got all of those in place. So now let's put these ones that I'm going to be... He's not going in there. He's going to go in another book. These ones that I will be searching for while I'm in the parks. And that is, of course, the quiet one. And then we got one more of those. And then below that, I'm going to put my Avenger Hidden Mickeys. And these are the first two in the series. So they go right in order. And then of course my Carousel of Progress, which I love. So this book is now ready for the parks and we are good to go. So we'll put this one aside. And next up, we are going to, let me get these pens. Oh, bring uh, this bad boy out. This guy's pretty big. So, let me show you how I have him set up. This is actually for baseball cards. Little sleeves for baseball cards. And 
I put them in like that. And we got these two. I don't know what one came out first. If it was Peter Pan, which I think it was the Mr. Toad. And there's 12 in this series. I got the last one coming to me in the mail. Actually, might be my mailbox that I haven't checked for a second. My bad. And then we got Mr. Toad. I know the other two are floating around in the mail somewhere. Um, in the room that I need to open for you guys. And then, of course, I got all of these. And now let's put these guys in here. These, I really don't care what order they go in. I love these pins. This is the first, like, rack pin that I've ever collected all the ones that they've released out of them. This one's broken. I'll put them in here. Uh-oh. Also, guys, let me know if you're collecting any of their monthly pen releases this year. Um, I didn't like any of them. And I'm so happy because I'm pretty much on a no buy with Disney this year. No buy to low buy. Um, this month, actually, I've not bought anything Disney. And I'm actually very proud of myself. So I just have a, some stuff to pay for. And it's just not in the books to buy Disney stuff. I actually just came back from my trip, like I said earlier, and I bought nothing absolutely nothing did not spend a penny in disney because i went with my dad he bought my meals for me which was nice and i was so happy that i was able to do what i said and didn't buy anything so and if we flip to the back of this book we got some these two are special pens for me that were given to me for my birthday i'm gonna put my vinyl mation series here i got more vinyls in other books so we will put those there. And then here we're going to put, um, let's put my Hidden Mickey series on this side. Next up, we got our country bears. I love this show. I know it's controversy, so I either love it or you hate it. I love it. I think it's hilarious. One more. Two complexion, com complexions. Com concoctions. 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 Good jeez, collections complete. So here's some more goofy pins. If you guys wanna see what I'm actually doing, I have to move over this board. But these are just goofy pins that I have. I'm not quite sure if I wanna keep that collection, get rid of that collection, don't know. But here's an ear hat. These are so hard to find. Oh, this is a pre-production. Oh my God, still don't know how I got that. Um, <laughs> so. Let's start with these and just stick them on the board. I might fix them later because I'm trying to reach around the camera and put these in. So, kind of difficult, not gonna lie. Putting these around the camera and they might need to be straightened because you guys are probably like, they're not straight. I know. Oh, I love this one, the scuttle. Autotopia. Okay. Next up, we're gonna put the Kingdom of Cute Series 1 up in here. If you guys have to pull it, let me know because 
Yeah, I've been looking for him and he's hard to find. I think he's pricey too. Fun fact, I've completed this collection. This is the third time or fourth time that I've tried completing it because I'm the type of person that buys pins and get rid of them all the time. All the time. And then we got series two and I only have three from series two. So I have, there's eight in each series. So I have a ways to go for this series, honestly. And I might not fit all of them on here. Oh, whoopsies. Let's go back to this page real quick. And put these bad boys on. We're actually gonna start down here. And this collection is complete. I finally found the, this one right here. It took me forever to get her. And of course, you think it would take me forever to get Figment, but no, it was Lilo that caused me all the problems. I want the, they have some other ones that I want. They have the mailboxes and the lunch boxes and I like the series of oh and the skates I like the series of ones that are like objects that are dressed as like the character I like those now back to this bad boy let's put our hugs up first and if you guys have any of these that I need to complete these collections for trade, definitely DM me on Instagram, which is put down below. Um, I do have some traders. Almost all of them are fantasy. So I'd be able to like try a few of these like smaller pins probably for those. Jasmine's all types. I put her on sideways and crooked and whatnot. Last but not least, we got our BFFs that we're gonna put down here. And it helps if you guys can see what I'm doing, right? I think I love these round pins. They did such, such a good job of doing these pins. So, kudos to you, Disney. I also like the heroes versus villains. And I had that collection at one point. And of course your girl got rid of it because that's all I do it's like I'll like something for a while then I get tired of it get rid of it then I want it again <sighs> oh a mess anyone else do that almost done I do have more pages that when we organize the other ones that can go in here and I can organize them a little bit different. So this might be reorganized again. And the last page is gonna be all goofy. So I don't. I lay them out before I press them down just to make sure I like how they're laying. I've been debating on getting rid of this collection like a good jillion times, but for now, he's staying with me. Because this is like one of the, I collect authentic goofy pens. Um, with some others. I want to put this one down here since they're all holiday. But yeah, I collect authentic goofy, uh, Fox and the, ha or Todd and Copper. Um, Todd and Copper, Winnie of the Pooh, and Stitch. But also, I do have some fantasy, and then I do have two fantasy, two collections that are just fantasy. And that is my Ariel collection and my 
drawer collection. I do have a lot more goofy pins to add to this page, so I'm thinking I'm gonna get another page for this book and just put Goofy on those two because this is getting filled up. This is like one of my favorite Goofies. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, almost knocked over the camera. But look, he's so freaking adorable. You see that? So cute. But I like, I don't collect Goofy in his orange. Unless he's like an object. So, that is all for today. Hope you enjoyed doing my pin book with me. And it was actually a 20 minute so video. So, and you got to see some of my pin collection. So I hope you all enjoyed and I'll see everyone very soon in the next video. Bye.